know this is going to be tremendous. The boys are going to be able to go on anything they want at any time. There's literally nobody here. just come off the second flight and feel like really sick it was um kung fu panda which is like a 3d ride and uh, normally on like roller coasters and that normally i'm fine but for some reason on this i just went green like shrek and i was sweating all over so i don't know how i'm gonna get on the rest of the day but we'll see so the next ride is how to train your dragon um, I'm gonna give it a go. I hope I'm all right. I should. Yes, yeah, someone's got motion sickness. Bad, 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 bad. Um, and let's hope I can just get through this one because apparently it's one of the best. Um, it's one of the best rides in the whole park. Wow! Look at this, guys. It is absolutely brilliant. This and the fact that this whole DreamWorks area is indoors. It's perfect for when it's so hot outside. But yeah, I think I've just spotted the roller coaster up there. Oh, see how I get on. See how I get on. <laughs> So I've just done um, the Madagascar roller coaster, which has made us feel even worse. I'm gutted because I never used to get like this when I was younger, but I feel dog sick. Um, I think I'd better sit sit out for maybe an hour or so because the last thing I want to do is what Grandad Rob did and sit all over the ride. Um, so yeah, I think I'm going to have to uh, be a substitute now for an hour or so, try and get myself back on track. Rides are amazing, absolutely amazing, but struggling. Nobody in Legoland Water Park, apart from us, literally nobody. So if you want to come to a water park and you want to go on straight on every single ride and have the water park to yourself, this is the time to come.
we've just stopped for a break. We're gonna have some food um, and drinks. You get this for about 60 dirhams. Um, it's free refills all day. But we just cannot get over how quiet the park is. You literally do not have to queue up to get on any of the rides. You just, it's as if, if you imagine like you've got a water park to yourself for the full day. It is literally, that's no exaggeration. Um, so yeah, brilliant. And you know, I think when you start looking into these things as well, you, they're not as expensive as you think. So we have got, um, for 200 pounds, we've got a night in the Lego hotel and a day pass at the Lego water park. Or you could have the normal Lego thing park. So for me, that is just an amazing, that's for all of us, all four of us, amazing value for money. Again, this time of year, um, it's, they're putting loads of offers on. Um, so yeah, if you come in this time of year, definitely check out Dubai parks and resorts. And yeah, we'll try and show you the room because the rooms and the hotel itself is just like brand spanking new. It's lovely. So, yeah, fill you in as the day goes on. So we're stopping in number 232 and it's the Indiana Jones themed room. So as you can see, the rooms are really spacious. There's a lot of Lego everywhere. How cute is that monkey? So I think all the rooms in this hotel sleep up to five. So I think they're all kind of very similar, but different theme. Um, so there's a separate bunk bed area for the kids. So they're gonna absolutely love this little area. So there's obviously double bunk and then there's a pull out bed there as well. It's just lovely, lovely Lego pieces everywhere. It's just lovely. Obviously the kids have got their own little TV. We're only here for one night. Um, but they're not going to want to check out. I know they're not going to want to. So we did put this as a little surprise for them. With it, it has been Seb's birthday. So um, I did just drop in that it was his birthday. So it was a lovely surprise actually. Because when we got here, they have left him a little card and a, and a little gift, which is really lovely. So yeah, the rooms are massive actually. They're really spacious. So obviously there's a separate area here for, for me and David. Um, I don't like snakes, so uh, they're not great, but never mind. In there, and there's a little um, quiz on here. So there's things that the kids have to find in the room. So that's great. How many red snakes are slivering across the floor? Brilliant. But there we go. Never mind. And I'll quickly show you the bathroom. Some cute little freebies there, which obviously, being very British, I'll pinch those. Oh, look at the hat. I like that. And then there's just a separate shower area. Oh, like this. And there's some Lego themed little shower gels and shampoos. So yeah, it's a great room. Love it. Like I say, the boys were gonna leave. So we're gonna have the day in the water park now. So we're uh, we'll checking later. So I'm just sat um, enjoying a nice cold beer. Kids and Emma are actually still in the park. I came back um, a couple hours ago because I was just so tired. Had a sleep, you can probably tell by my eyes. Had a sleep, a shower, and I feel a little bit more refreshed. I don't know, it's just caught up with us doing so much over the last few days. Um, last 30 days. Or what, but I just felt absolutely shot this afternoon. Probably a little bit of motion sickness, a little bit of sun, a little bit of tiredness. Um, but uh, the park's absolutely brilliant, and to be able to constantly get on the rides, whatever you want to go on, whenever you want to go on, is a definite plus for me and definite reason to come back to Dubai at this time of year, especially for families. So I think the park's open till. 8 p.m. I think so. Just got a message from Emma just saying they've been on everything about 20 times. So yeah, so just having a bit of chill time, catching up with a bit of work, a couple of emails, etc. And then I think we've got to do it all again tomorrow because we um, booked into Legoland Park tomorrow. So yeah, let's see what tomorrow brings. But another successful day. 
and uh, I'll try and get a bit of feedback from the gang when they're back. We are at the Legoland theme park. As you can see in the background, there's literally full of Dubai. Uh, this is like the first, the first zone you go into. Um, and yeah, it's pretty cool. So it's our last day here at the Legoland stroke motion gate stroke Dubai parks. Um, we're having a day here, but then we're gonna go back to our hotel. And then we've got two days left. Can you believe it? Um, out of about 34, we've got two days left. So after this, I think we're gonna, have two, we're gonna pick our two best beach and pool days and just relax. So yeah, keep following us today. If you wanna know what Legoland Dubai is like, Yeah.